Day 5 of the Asian Championships brought us unforgettable moments and outstanding lifts, which made this competition day one of the most thrilling and historical in the women's 71 kilo Olympic weight category. The atmosphere is gonna become more tense. Turokti Media. As we are moving closer to the halfway point of this race and heavyweight categories with other big names. Don't miss a chance to witness an intensive battle between the leaders of the 71 kilo weight division who were set to push their limits, improve their prior lifts, and hit Asian and world records. Watch the video till the end to find out who will reign today by celebrating victory for their country. Today, 12 female lifters were in the podium, showcasing their commitment and determination to get a winning medal and a quota for participation in the Olympic Games in Paris this summer. Song Guk Young is a profound weightlifting champion who took gold in the 76 kilo weight category at the 2023 Asian Games. Chen Wen Hui, a Taiwanese lifter who took bronze at the 2023 Asian Championships in Jinju. In 2020, she won silver at the Asian Champs in Tashkent in the 64 kilo weight class. Also, she participated in the Olympic Games in Tokyo and won bronze. Moon Min Hee, the bronze medalist in the women's 75 kilo division at the 2018 Asian Games. Rune Segawa from Japan, who set the national record of 129 kilos in clean and jerk during the Asian Championships in 2023. The performance in the snatch exercise started from 50 kilograms. On this contest day, 64% of all attempts were successful, which is an above average rate. Now let's analyze the top three lifters' performance. The bronze holder Moon Min Hee from South Korea had two successful lifts, 97 kilos on the first attempt. The second try of 101 kilos was failed, while the third attempt of 102 kilograms brought her a bronze medal in the snatch portion. Chen Wen Hui from Taipei got a silver medal with a good lift of 108 kilograms. Today, she showed excellent performance with all three successful lifts. 102 kilos on the first attempt, 106 on the second try, and the last try was a winning one. The leader in snatch became Sang Guk Young, who finished with a 7 kilos cushion ahead of the second place, namely 115 kilos. Despite her first attempt of 115 kilos, she accumulated her inner strength and lifted the same weight of 115 kilos on the second attempt, which brought her first place. She wanted to break the senior world record in snatch of 120 kilos, but unfortunately her third attempt of 122 kilos was not successful.
Overall, the lifters showed good results with a minimal rate of no lifts. Just four athletes had two red lights. While the majority performed successful lifts, which was indicated as 64% of all attempts. We also outlined the top six athletes who were highly determined to occupy the leading positions. Thus, we witnessed tough competition between the athletes from the sixth to the third spots. The silver medalist surpassed the bronze holder by six kilos, while falling behind the winner by seven. The contest in the clean and jerk discipline started with a weight of 60 kilograms. Fifty-three percent of all attempts in these exercises were successful, which is a below average rate. Let's describe the performance of the top three lifters. The South Korean lifter Moon Min Hee took bronze, lifting 129 kilos from the second try. She started with a weight of 125 kilos on the first try. Then increased it by 4 kilos and succeeded in lifting the bar overhead. The last attempt was 132 kilograms, but she didn't cope with it. Silver moved to the Japanese athlete Rune Segawa. She didn't lift 124 kilos on the first attempt, but then rehabilitated and succeeded in lifting the same weight during the second try. The third try was 6 kilos more, 130, which she lifted gradually and won the silver medal. Son Guk Young reigned the session again by clinching second gold. The first attempt of 145 kilos and the second of 154 were both successful and having a weight gap of an impressive 24 kilograms compared to the second place, she decided to withdraw from the third attempt. The clean and jerk round was no less intensive than the snatch session. However, we had more no lifts. It's not surprising as the atmosphere was pretty tense and intriguing, since everyone wanted to occupy high positions in the category's ranking. A new senior world record in clean and jerk was set by Song Guk Young. She lifted 154 kilos, which is 1 kilo more than the previous record of 153 kilos. It needs to be mentioned that almost all athletes failed to cope with their third attempts, except the Japanese lifter, while all successful lifts were done on the first tries. 
So the category's bronze holder became South Korean weightlifter Mo Min Hee, who got 231 kilograms in total, falling behind her rival from the second place by 5 kilos. The silver medalist was Chen Wen Hui from Taipei, who did 236 kilograms in total, which was 33 kilos less than her rival from the first place. Today's winner was Song Guk Young, who finished her performance with a result of 269 kilos in the sum of two exercises. Just four kilos left to shatter a new senior world record in total that Song Guk didn't manage to achieve. To summarize the performance in the women's 71 kilo weight category, we can confirm that the competition was eye-hooking with lots of thrilling moments. It wasn't easy to foresee the whole ranking, as there was an even battle and true competition between female lifters. Overall, all of them were of equal power and everyone had all chances to occupy a spot in the top six. It was quite obvious to define the category's favorites, as the weight gap between the supposed leaders and the rest of the contenders was great enough to remain securely in their positions. Keep watching our reviews to know first about the most interesting and intriguing moments of the most competitive Olympic categories and the most talented lifters to see the history created right now. Don't miss the birth of new warriors who will become decent opponents to the category's favorites. Subscribe to our channels, follow our social media, and share our videos.